Dylan Thompson, Chase Motorsports, Coach and Trailer Sales, Paducah, Kentucky. I hope you're having a great day. I've got a super nice coach to show you guys. Uh, today we've got a 2022 Renegade XL, 45 foot on the Freightliner Cascadia chassis. Uh, just a shade over 7,100 miles. This is a one owner quad slide coach, so four slides. Um, it's got a lot of nice options, as you can see uh, from this side, the, uh, the nice patio awning, outdoor entertainment. Uh, this coach has got the automatic hydraulic leveling system, aqua hot, uh, 600 horsepower under the hood with the 12 speed ultra shift transmission. So we'll take a uh, quick stroll around the outside of it here and then we'll go through the interior. Uh, the coach does have full body paint with uh, clear coat on it. So easy to, uh, to maintenance and, um, and keep cleaned up super nice. The XL uh, is one of the uh, nicer units that you'll find that Renegade makes. Uh, it's just got a few bells and whistles over the classic and um, we'll take you around and show you a little bit about it. So uh, as you can see, Freightliner, Cascadia, the new style front end. Uh, as we mentioned, the full body paint, you can see the design there. Uh, polished aluminum wheels. We actually just polished those fresh uh, yesterday. So um, polished aluminum gives it a chrome look when our uh, polished guy gets a hold of them. Uh, the uh, generator's got around 270 or 80 hours, I believe, if I read it correctly. And we, uh, we do service every coach that comes through here. So the generator... Uh, we'll be at zero hours essentially on the service and uh, we do recommend service in the Onan at about every 200 hours. And this one does have the Onan 12.5 uh, generator. Uh, as we make our way around the tail of the coach, we do have the 40,000 pound hitch. Um, right now it's got the, uh, the big um, three inch receiver in it, but I do have a two and five sixteenths ball. Um, I've got uh, different hitches. I've even got a pinnel hitch in stock. So um, a Renegade pre-wires these coaches for the Voyager uh, backup camera system. So you do have a camera up here above the coach. Of course, uh, when you're backing up, you can see uh, the back. But that one is uh, down here is actually a connection for your trailer. So uh, you can call Voyager Cam and uh, get the camera for the back of your trailer. And uh, luckily enough, Renegade does the hard part when they build the coach. They pre-wire it. Uh, the uh, Renegade XL here is also already plumbed with glad hand fittings. Um, they put the nipples back here, and then we keep the uh, glad hand fittings in stock. So if you need those, if you're pulling a trailer with air ride or air brakes, uh, we can make sure before it leaves our facility, you are set up and ready to go. Um, down this side, the first uh, two bays you see here on the right rear corner are going to be storage. Uh, then on up, one of those up there is Aqua Hot, and I think the other two are storage. So lots of storage on this side. One thing I was real surprised this one didn't have was the um, outdoor electric cooler. But here's the deal. I've got them in stock. I've got the sliding tray kit in stock. So if that's something you wanted, I'm sure we can, we can make it happen on this one. So uh, as you can see, I've got the, um, the uh, curbside uh, scene lights on, very bright. They kind of go out under that uh, awning nicely. So, uh, and then you can see it's got the big, probably a 43 inch or so uh, Samsung outdoor TV with the um, sound bar underneath it. So, um, this one's pretty loaded up. I looked at the build sheet. Uh, it dots a lot of the I's and, and crosses the T's for sure. So, uh, let's take a uh, quick stroll through the inside. I try to keep these videos uh, short and sweet because I don't want anyone losing interest or, or getting bored with them, but also want to show you a little bit about each one. So as we enter in here, we're going to spin to the right, uh, which will put us on the curb side of the coach. And uh, you can see we've got a slide out there, uh, kitchen area, which is going to feature the uh, Samsung convection microwave and the two burner induction cooktop. So you can see it's under there. There's one burner there and then another one under the other cover. Over here, you've got the big uh, single bowl stainless sink. I think the uh, cabinetry in this one's the Italian nutmeg, so not a super big shine, but got a little bit of a gloss finish to it. I like it. Um, over here, you've got a Samsung TV that actually drops down uh, behind this uh, little love seat, so uh, you can drop it down to where, you know, if you're driving the coach, you want to... Um, 
look over your right shoulder. You can look out that window, but when you get parked, you can raise that dude up and have a nice TV there. Um, I do love on this XL how the cab is a uh, like a walkthrough cab, so you don't have to duck down and and uh, and squeeze up into the cab. It's got uh, plenty of height and an area to get down in there. Kind of show you around. It's already pre-wired for a CB, so if you wanted that, we do keep those in stock. Uh, this one's got the Garmin in dash navigation uh, all built in. Again, seventy one hundred miles and uh, two thousand twenty two model we're looking at here. Uh, up there's your equalizer system, which is also the EQ smart level. It is Bluetooth compatible. You can download the app on your phone and stand outside the coach and level the whole thing. Over here on the um, the driver's side, or we call the um, the street side, we've got a sofa that does turn into a bed. It does turn into a queen size hide a bed with an air mattress. Uh, it comes with the air pump and everything to set that guy up. Um, something on this coach that they did is the, uh, the electric shade. So there's a controller, uh, back here in a drawer behind me, you get it down. It's a remote wireless controller and you can run all the shades up and down with that. So it's on the night side. Now the, um, the day shades, which is like a uh, perforated, uh, kind of makes the window look tinted in a sense. Those are still uh, manual, but the night shades, um, in this one are powered. Um, over here, we also have more sleeping capacity. We've got a booth-style dinette. Uh, that white table there in the middle does drop down. Uh, if you'll check out the uh, online photo album, we got some pictures showing how that's set up. But that uh, center leaf drops down, a couple little foam cushions go in the middle, and makes a bed. So this coach sleeps, uh, you know, let's say two on the queen uh, sofa hide bed We got two there on the, um, the booth-style dinette. And then we've also got two in the king size bed in the back. So six comfortable, not counting. You know, you've got a little one traveling with you or something. They could bunk down on the little love seat. Uh, this coach does have the Samsung uh, digital inverter fridge, which is the full size French door. Um, open it up. We've got lots of storage on top. And then down in the bottom, we have a pull out freezer. Uh, with a built-in ice maker, too. So this one does have the ice maker built in. Uh, quite a bit of storage in it. As you can see here in the kitchen area around, you've got a little pull-out pantry. I can show you right here. All these drawers pull out so you can store whatever you got there. Um, this one is um, it's already set up with a multiplex, the digital coach control system. So as you can see, we're on the home screen right now. We've got our light master, our aqua hut electric or um, or diesel burner, our engine preheat. Uh, we've got our water pump switch, our tank levels, uh, generator hours. There we go, 280 hours. Uh, you can scroll through this and it shows you, you know, AC input, uh, shows your air conditioning settings. Uh, this one does have bay heat. So if you're uh, in an area with a cold climate, you can turn the aqua hot on, turn the bay heat on, and it's going to blow warm air uh, down in your storage bays. But um, you can literally control everything from the leveling, the awning, uh, the slide outs, all the lighting. Everything is controlled uh, by this. And cool thing, too, you can download the app on your phone and literally control the whole coach from your phone. It'll be a screen very similar to what you see there. Um, this is a bath and a half. That's probably one of the more important things that I did not mention. Uh, you've got just a small, simple half bath here, um, little vanity medicine cabinet with a mirror, some storage above, and then a sink and the uh, commode. It, both commodes in this one, uh, both uh, toilets are electric flush. Um, back behind across from the half bath, we've got the washer and dryer. So we're going to have a washing machine on the bottom, a uh, dryer on the top. So it is a stack system, very nice and neat, already installed into the coach. Uh, then we'll make our way on back into the bedroom. Uh, we do have uh, sliding pocket doors uh, on each side of the bedroom with magnetic catches, so very neat setup there. Uh, again, the big Samsung 43-inch TV in the wardrobe there, which is, uh, you know, also there's two slides back here. So you got one slide on our king bed and a, a posing cross for mint. We've got another slide, so you open both of them up and, and plenty of room. Um, something else I didn't mention that I, I just kind of things come to mind here as I'm walking through the coach is heated floors. So uh, this uh, this coach has dual zone heated floors, meaning we've got uh, a controller that's controlling the front 
half of the coach, and then we've got a controller uh, back here that's controlling the bedroom and the bathroom. So you can set those bad boys on 75, 80 degrees, and ladies and gentlemen, I'm telling you, it'll heat the whole coach without the actual heat on. It's crazy what uh, radiant heat uh, can do. Uh, back here, we've got the master bath. We'll spin to the left. We've got another one of the um, electric flush vacuum toilets, and then a uh, little sink, vanity, uh, another medicine cabinet with a mirror, and then we've got the um, uh, tiled shower. So it's got the nicer shower in it, uh, all the stainless fixtures and sliding glass doors there. So I believe I touched on everything. Again, try not to go too far in depth. Just kind of want to ski through things. Uh, you do have 150 gallons of fresh water located under the bed with a 75-gallon capacity fresh and a 75, um, or excuse me, 75 gray and 75-gallon black tank. So 150 fresh and then 75, 75 on the gray and black. Um, and it's a 2022 model Renegade XL on the Freightliner Cascadia chassis with the 600 horse DD16 Detroit engine and the 12-speed ultra shift transmission uh, loaded with about all the bells and whistles you can put on one. It is a one-owner coach. Uh, it was uh, from Florida, so uh, it's seen uh, good warm weather most of its life, and uh, it's in immaculate condition. we uh, we done the cleanup and serviced the generator on it today. Done a very basic detail. It didn't need much. Uh, the owner, uh, not really sure why they got rid of it, just a little change of plans on what they uh, had going on, and and so uh, they called us and, and we purchased it. But would love to earn your business. We do buy, we sell, we trade, we do some consignments too. Uh, mainly anything you see that I post is going to be something that, um, that we own. Uh, we do a few consignments, but uh, would love to earn your business, and uh, we do offer some uh, really good financing with approved credit. Uh, we also, uh, like I said, take trades too. So my name is Dylan Thompson, Chase Motorsports Coach and Trailer Sales. Uh, we're based out of Paducah, Kentucky. We're right off Interstate 24, uh, about two hours northwest of Nashville, Tennessee. And uh, we are about uh, three hours southeast, I guess, of St. Louis. So uh, right here by the Tennessee, Illinois, kind of in that part of Kentucky. But Again, would love to earn your business. Let me know what we can do. Um, you can call or text me anytime, 270-556-8461. Again, 270-556-8461. Uh, we do offer nationwide delivery too. So uh, call me and we can discuss that if you need some help uh, getting the coach to uh, your house or wherever it's going. Uh, our website is race-haulers.com. That's going to be R A C E dash haulers, H A U L E R S dot com. Uh, give us a, a like on Facebook. We're also on Instagram and, uh, and then our YouTube channel. We'd love to have you hit that subscribe button that helps us out. And, and that way you can keep following us for any content we put on. So, um, again, Dylan Thompson, Chase Motorsports Coach and Trailer Sales, Paducah, Kentucky. I appreciate you watching this and uh, let me know if I can help you. Have a good one.